Just another cautionary tale about using cloud-based systems because who actually owns the data? And who says that they're not going to suddenly change what you get access to or charge you a lot of money? Previously, Slack received a lot of complaints about using AI on personal data. This is from 2024. Slack is using your private conversations to train its AI. Just another reminder that your Slack DMs are not private. And then we had hackers who could use Slack's AI features to expose private channel messages. And just recently, this is from the register, Slack threatened to delete nonprofit coding club's data if it didn't pay $50,000 in a week. The CEO did try to smooth things over, but Hack Club now plans a strategy shift. This is because Slack sent a nonprofit hacking club for teens a demand for $50,000 payable within a week and threatened to delete the club's message archive if it did not pay. So this is a hack club which is a nonprofit that works to run coding clubs at high schools. They use Slack as an integral part of the organization's offline community. The whole idea here is that you code together and find your programming community. A few years ago, when Slack transitioned them from a free nonprofit plan to a 5,000 a year arrangement, they happily paid. It was reasonable and we valued the service they provided our community. But just think about that. They went from having a free plan with Slack because they are a nonprofit to $5,000 a year, which they thought was reasonable, to Slack being totally unreasonable. Slack reached out to us and said that if we don't agree to pay an additional $50,000 this week and $200,000 a year, they'll deactivate our Slack workspace and delete all of our message history. Now, they did say that Slack is free to stop providing us the nonprofit offer at any time, but in their opinion, a six month grace period is bare minimum for a massive hike like this, if not more. So basically what's happened here is a massive company, Salesforce, is strong arming a small nonprofit for teams by providing less than a week to pony up a pretty massive sum of money or risk cutting off all of their communities. They say that that's absurd. So they've decided to move to a rival open source platform Form. So this is the problem, right? If you use a cloud-based solution like Slack or any other cloud-based solution, what's stopping them from changing their prices and increasing them massively or threatening to delete all your data, all of your messages, etc.? Who's in control of your data? Do you honestly think you're in control of your private messages and your other data if you are using a cloud-based solution? But what are your thoughts? Would you use something like Slack or would you move to open source solutions? Would you use offline solutions rather than cloud-based? So many times we've seen that companies will use your data and they're gonna train their AIs on your data.